Hello Aquarius and welcome to your weekly love reading. This is April from 33 and above Tarot and here we're going to check into the energies this week in your love life. Um, please note these messages are general and if you're interested in booking a private reading, the information is in the description box below. Also, please check your Venus sign. That is your love sign. All right, so let's get into it. Aquarius. What is going on with Aquarius this week in their love life? Excuse the noise in the background. My pup decides to, you know, do her thing once I start filming. So you know how this goes. <laughs> I love her though. Um, let's go. Whoa, this popped out. We have the Four of Cups in reverse, the Five of Wands, the Three of Swords in reverse, the Queen of Wands, and the Three of Pentacles. All right. So it looks like here, Aquarius, um, you decided to choose happiness. You decided that you you stop you stop dealing with these mind games that um, that has been occurring in this relationship. Um, you are focused on your healing, and you're taking no shit. You're taking none. It's like. Don't approach me with any BS because I have a feeling people want to because I think you are a person that people seek advice from, um, but you're not taking any, you know, you're, you're just not dealing, no, <laughs> no, you have, you have had to go and gain a lot of courage to be in this position though. It doesn't, you can't just get into the queen of wands position just to, you know, for it just to happen. Like you literally work for that position. You've been through a lot. There's so much um, conflict that it caused you to go and heal. And, and it's like, It's like you wanted something and now you don't want it anymore. And you you contemplated, but you just knew that it wasn't. You, you were made aware of something. And it's just dealing with this person is... It's like... You might be dealing, I mean, there's one, I feel that there are a lot of people involved in this situation. I feel that there are a lot of opinions or there possibly could be a lot of opinions or there's just too much conflict in this situation. But I, I see a lot of people involved. And everyone's confused. I think everyone's getting different stories. Somebody's talking too much too. But you are no longer dealing with this. You are moving on because you need some healing. And this is great because you are protective of your heart. And you may have needed to get advice on this situation. And if you feel like you can't get any advice because, you know, sometimes having too many people involved in your business is a little bit too much, you know, too many opinions that you either went within or you may have gone to like see someone else to talk about, you know, to figure out what's going on or to maybe get some counseling. Um that happens that is not related someone that's not related to your situation you know so you don't have a biased opinion but it's just uh you decided to just say you know what to hell with this 
to hell with this. You're not dealing with this because you are protecting your heart and you should, you know. I someone um You're very, I mean, you might be in a position, uh, Aquarius, that you're unapproachable. So even if someone wanted to come in, it's like you are you have an intimidating stance. Because they know they can't, they can't come to you with this BS, you know? And so that's right. You, you know, protect your, come correct. <laughs> someone needs to come correct. And they do, and they will, and I don't know when, but it's like they do want to work with you. They do want to come together. This also may be a third-party situation, if I not did not say that before. Um, wealthy man. So this is someone who pretends like they have it all, but don't have anything. This one, this is a person who is a little showy. Just uh, materialistic. They know they can't fake it with you. That's what it is. They know they can't fake it with you because they know you will call them out. Yeah, because they're trapped right now. Imprisonment. They're feeling trapped. You are in a position where you're looking for and working on your stability. You're wanting something stable with an individual. You need stability. You need commitment. And you're not you're not dealing with this third party BS. You're not. And this person knows you're not dealing with it anymore. They know they cannot lie to you and fake it. Mm -hmm. But you are working. You might be. Um, you might be working with other people too. With three of with the three of pentacles here, and with the community card here, which is broken down. Thirty nine is broken down to a, a twelve, which is a three. Um, you in the three of swords here it's like you have this people want to work with you aquarius and this may not just be you know um love i know this is a love reading but people i feel like people want to work with you and this person if this is a third party this person wants to you to like still be you know like involved with this third party you know be careful with that <clears throat> you know that is not you know mm -mm. that's not good juju <clears throat> you're not dealing with them they know they can't <clears throat> excuse me i can't talk i can't speak it's hard my throat I need to, <clears throat> someone needs to work on their throat chakra. Distant horizons. You are, um, you're, you're, something is coming for you. This person is coming. So there's two situations here. You, I see you moving towards something that is not this person. And it's something where it's like leading to you to work with other people. But this person's also, this person's stuck. <clears throat> it's like you healed yourself and moved on or moving on. And this person is now stuck. And they don't know, they know they can't approach you and, and get, you know, feed you lies. They know you're not dealing, going to deal with this third party situation. They got, they have to come authentic because 
and they may have a they are having trouble speaking with you so you know they're they're very intimidated because they know that they're in the wrong you know this is person who pretends like nothing's wrong but everything is wrong <laughs> it's like that like don't be fooled by what people show you okay aquarius be mindful of people who present themselves to you trying to like pretend like they know it all they have it all and then they try to you know play mind games make you believe these illusions about them but in reality it, it's all lies it's like the smoke cleared Mhm. Mm the smoke cleared for you and now it's like you're off onto something you're soaring through And if you're feeling like this is tough or if, you know, it might be like you are not exactly sure where you're going to go, you know, call out your, your guides, your angels. Because you're never, you know, you're never alone in this. You're a passionate person that deserves someone equally and or more passionate about you. And that would not put you in compromising situations, you know? So it's not your problem if this person is stuck. You're focused on your healing and continue to focus on your healing. Because you... <laughs> Don't worry. You got this. You know, you're focused on your healing, Aquarius. You come first. Because you cannot feel from an empty cup. And, you know, now the smoke is cleared what you're going to do. All right, Aquarius, thank you so much. I hope these re this reading resonated with you. If it did, please hit the like button. Please comment and subscribe. Thank you so much, and have a wonderful week. I'll talk to you later. Bye.